guys welcome back to our channel tonight i'm going to be cooking lasagna because i've decided during my quarantine i might as well get good at something and so i chose cooking so the first thing i'm going to do is take these lasagna noodles they're kroger brand and boil them so that's good i'm going to use this big pot i'm going to fill with water and boil these noodles and I will check in with you when I move on to the next step. I guess I'll show you what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna open these. And then plop them in the water. I've never made a lasagna before, so. And I refuse to look up a recipe, so. I'm just gonna do it and see what happens. I feel like I've seen my mom make it enough to where like I should be fine. As they boil down, oh, you can't see them. But as the noodles boil down, they'll obviously like shrivel and go into there. And so now I'm gonna prepare the meat. So for me, I'm gonna be using Italian sausage because um, there's no ground beef to be found anywhere, and I'm not gonna start cooking it just yet. Because I don't think it will take long to cook. But I'm also going to add ricotta cheese. I'm going to add my, or medium cheddar cheese. And this Italian style cheese. some onion that I'm going to chop to add to the meat for flavor. Or that's not onion. Sorry, those are apples. I'm going to use the onion, not these apples. We have to. You need it to, like, you don't, you won't think it's gross. It's to flavor the meat. You're childish if you don't like something like that. I feel like I'm making sure, I'm going to use this Italian seasoning on the meat too, making sure your meat is flavored well I think is like very important and can make or break your lasagna, not that I've ever made one and would know that. <laughs> and for sauce, I'm going to use this organic four cheese red sauce because I think that'll be good. So I'm going to go chop this and then I'll be back. So the onions are chopped and Jacob's just dicing them more. Right now I'm going to prepare the meat so that I can be like nice and seasoned because um, in this house we um, season our meat. So I'm just using this sweet Italian sausage that I got. I was gonna take about, I hate touching me. Don't take like half of the packaging. Plop it in a bowl. I'll show you guys in a minute. I'm just gonna put that in the freezer so I can stay fresh for longer. So here's our bowl of meat and what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a little bit of seasoned salt to it. I think that's important on everything. Well, I should have like a meat tenderizer, but I guess I'll just like massage it in with my hands. Mm. Just really working it in. Next seasoning I'm going to add is this McCormick Perfect Pinch Italian Seasoning. Do a high up that will be good. Let's do 
let's see. Sorry, y'all are um, in my armpit. <laughs> a tiny bit of onion powder, not a ton. And then I'm just going to massage it. And then I'm going to put it in a skillet and cook it once the noodles have boiled down more. Just so it's not like sitting there waiting to be made. I'm also going to use this olive oil spray when I make my meat just so it doesn't get sticky or anything. Oh, and um, I'm going to be making some Hawaiian rolls. These are so good. I'm just going to put them in the oven with... I wish I had honey, like honey butter sauce is so good. Let's see if you have any honey, because that would slap. Can you hold these? Like maybe. Because we'll put those in the other last, like when the lasagna is almost done. I'm not sure I take to preheat. I wouldn't know, because it doesn't have, there's no oh, no. I just, yes. My oven has um no inclination to tell me like when the heck the oven is preheated. So I do have to guess. And this is a new oven because our old one stopped working and started smelling like gas all the time. It's going to be very hot, Jacob. Mm -hmm. What an attitude of me. Mm-hmm. Ooh. The noodles are almost done boiling. This is my bedroom. My door says Tyler's lair. Ouch. I'm so excited. What if it's gross? I hope not. It will be. Mm-hmm. So now I'm gonna spray my skillet with this this nonstick olive oil spray. I need to get some of that. Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna take my meat, slap it in, and then I'm gonna put my chopped onions, thanks to Jacob, in. If you guys want to see more cooking, I have a food Instagram. I actually posted how I made my breakfast today on there on a story. And I just have like a cooking highlight for when I make stuff. I'm just like such a foodie. I'm always eating. So I was like, why not just like have like a food gram? Basically for this meat, I'm just like, here I'll show you what it looks like in the skillet. I'm just like doing that until it's cooked. Don't you just love how precise my terminology for everything is? You have such a good movie. <laughs> but it's like, you can tell when like sausage and like ground beef is done because it turns like gray and not like pink or red anymore. And I had a little more of the Italian seasoning as it cooks to make sure it doesn't leave any flavor. Because flavorless meat is disgusting. One time, I won't name names, but this girl I know was making chicken and all she did was put like a piece of chicken in a skillet and cook it. Like that's it, like not even salt or pepper. Like the bare minimum. Like when I make like chicken in the skillet, like which is like kind of like grilled chicken, but like not really. Like basically, I always put hella seasoning on it. Like if I'm gonna eat, like it's gonna be good. I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> sweating cooking this right now. It's been storming all day. It's such a gloomy day. If the world sound already gloomy enough. Looking back in because I'm adding a few red pepper flakes to the sausage just to give it a little bit of spice. Mmm, it smells good. Just making sure all the pieces are fully cooked. The noodles are looking good. They're all boiled down now. I'm just going to leave them in for a little longer so that they can um, 
get soft. Let's see if I can open this jar. Come on. Here. You might have to use a knife on it. Oh my gosh, it's like slippery. You know how sometimes like. you have to like just like hit it with a knife? Mm -hmm. I don't know why my mom taught me this, but if you can't ever um, open a jar, take the end of a knife. And then it opens. I don't know why. If you need a trick of the day. Oh my god, you guys almost flew into the pasta. <gasps> If I would have just boiled my phone during a quarantine. <laughs> oh my god. I just like need a breather. That was literally like three inches away from just landing like, in the pot. <laughs> Y'all literally did a somersault like this close into the boiling noodles. Like you don't even understand. I'm like worked up. <laughs> I would have actually sobbed if I boiled my phone today. <laughs> that was just not in the itinerary, like not in my agenda. I, maybe tomorrow. Yeah, like maybe tomorrow, but certainly not today. I ordered a yoga mat on Amazon so I can do some at-home workouts. Maddie's mom is like a fitness instructor, so I'm gonna see if she'll like- Hook it up. Hook me up and like give me some free classes via FaceTime. Zoom. Maybe Whatever we wind up using. Gosh. She'll like zoom me into her workout classes. Things get confusing because I have a sister named Maddie and then, you know, me and Maddie have this channel together and we're technically sisters <laughs> through our sorority. So I'm always like, Jacob, Maddie did this and he's like, okay, which one? <laughs> I'm like, oh shoot, yeah. These noodles are looking real soft and real good. I'm going to let them boil for like another minute or two. But they're looking nice and soft and like not chewy. I'm going to like just break one. And see if it's like chewy. Still kind of chewy. I don't know why the water like won't boil. Oh my! Oh. Had a little bit of salt. Tyler, look at this. You're not ready. Like, be ready for this. What is he about to show me? What happened? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I was like, why is he like dead on the ground? <laughs> That's a cute puppy. Can we show the video? Or are you just gonna cut that out? You can I think show. it'd be funny to have your reaction to that. Yeah, do you, do you want to see like what I just saw? Let's make this work. That's a dog that um, ate a dragon fruit and made a mess all over himself. Not what you would think it is at first. <laughs> Thank you for the explanation. Adding a little salt to the water because you know salt makes water boil fast. You have to cut this out of the video. Have a smell. I can't stop. Working. Just like trap all the heat. I feel like that'll force it to boil, right? Like, them boys hot. Yeah, that bitch had these. Oh no, guys, I've had an accident. It got very hot and very bubbly, but it worked. So, fire did go everywhere because the water got in the flame because we don't have an electric stove. I'm gonna do it again so I don't boil more. But this time I'll uncap it before it explodes it everywhere. 
Just because, like, they need a good boy. Like, I don't want chewy noodles. strain these noodles and I'll have Jacob grab the camera so you can like see me prepare the lasagna. Oh the handles are ow that hurts hurting I need that I'm gonna prepare the lasagna they're hot I'm sorry Lay them flat. The first thing. Ouch. So I'll do one more. And then I'm going to take this spoon of ricotta cheese and just kind of. ricotta on this layer so i guess i'm gonna do sauce meat cheese just so it has something to stick to on you tonight please comment <laughs> i need someone else on my side in this battle i just don't get the point of playing the same game over and over and over like it'd be different to me like i like, like my favorite video game is super mario brothers there's like levels like you're every doing, game something different happens yeah but like you're doing the exact like there's no like you just like win to win like you don't like advance you don't move on like i just don't get that personally but, like if that's like what you find fun like whatever makes you happy the first time you win the battle royale and get that rush going through your entire body hit me up have you ever <laughs> I stream myself playing Super Mario Brothers. Do you think there's a... You can stream cooking on Twitch and stuff. People do stuff like that. They literally, like, stream themselves, like, cooking and just doing stuff around the house. That's what Ninja's wife used to do. Maybe I'll do that. I don't know why she was there, but Maybe. that's how they met. She was just trying to, um... Find her a gamer boy. Pick up a gamer. A little e-boy action, get you some know? Get that gamer money. Mm-hmm. Well, gamer money wasn't gamer money back then. It's to move. Well, if you um don't allow me to play video games, I can't guarantee anything, so. I allow, <laughs> he's acting like, I'm like, if you play another video game, I'm gonna break up with you. Tyler put a parental timer on my PlayStation, so it turns <laughs> off every um 10 minutes. That's not true. That is true. But I don't even get to play entire games when I play. That is a lie, because first of all, if you've met me, you know that I don't do all the technology, so there's no way I'd not. She set made up. me do it on my own PlayStation. <laughs> there's no way I'd not have set up. Isn't that right? A parental control on anything. I didn't even know a PlayStation could have that. But, like, thanks for telling me that information now. Because I might look up how to do it. So good. I cannot wait to eat this. I'm like, like so hungry. Same. Just like cooking it. Should we put the bread in the oven yet? No, we're gonna put it in there when the lasagna is almost done because they just need to heat. Like they don't need to like cook them. Mm -hmm. We'll probably only leave this in for. A yeah. And then the meat. We're getting there, everybody. There's not much meat left. And the top layer just has i'm gonna have lots of free time to edit this video so it should be cool because my boyfriend's just gonna play his video game so i'll have to have something to entertain myself. <laughs>
That is correct. More cheese. More cheese. I promise we're not sponsored by Kroger Medium Cheddar Shredded Cheese. <laughs> but like if they're trying to sponsor. But hit us up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Tyler does this thing where she um, just says exactly the same thing that I'm saying at the exact same time <laughs> without coordinating it, and it kind of scares me a lot. I think I am slightly psyched. Sometimes I will be texting Tyler a question, and as I'm typing it, she will just answer it, and it'll be a random question completely out of the blue that has nothing to do with what we're talking about, and she just randomly <laughs> sends me an answer to the question before I even finish typing my message. I'm just so insane. I don't know. It's crazy. I didn't realize like how much ingredient to use to make a lasagna. Like I, yeah, I was like thinking about it as you started making it. I was like, damn, I hope we have enough of everything to make more than like yeah. two layers. Cause like you just have to put so much of it yeah. multiple times. This is the last layer. It's gonna have just sauce and then Italian cheese. Mm. I do have some sharp cheddar, but I don't know where. What? Don't you just, I'm like ASMR glass scraping against <laughs> a metal spoon. Mm. Don't you guys love that sound? A euphoric sound. Comment if you love that sound. <laughs> so now we're going to put it in the oven. Show them what it looks like. Show them what it looks like. Mm. Mm. Comment if you think that looks good. And you know it, this is heavy. Like, pick this up. It's heavier than you'd think. Just like, I'll just like. Oh, shit. It's like 10 pounds. Yeah, like the noodle's heavy, I guess. It's a workout. Ooh. How long are you putting it in there for? I don't know. I'm gonna keep checking it till the cheese melts. Okay. Cause like, well, I guess I'm gonna show you me put buttering. You put buttering? I think you should just restate that. <laughs> me buttering. Honey buttering these. I'm just gonna literally pour it on top. I have some um, homemade honey butter. Very complicated recipe. It's so complicated. I'll let you guys Google it and figure out how to make it. We like actually made it in. Got it. Ooh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Comment if you um just watch this video at all, any part of it. Like comment. Just comment, you like you it, comment subscribe again. Subscribe again. Yeah, make another account, subscribe. Subscribe to it on your school email, your personal email, and your spam email. Well, I guess we'll come back to y'all when everything's done. I have confetti cupcakes later. I'm feeling hungry tonight. Like, I wanted to eat. I want to feast. And then I got these cute cupcake tins because these are the only ones I could find. Why is this soaking wet? Do you see that? Do you see this? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay guys, so we got it out the oven. It's... Oh my. I'm excited. This lighting's kind of messing it up. And want some lasagna. Come hit us up. Please hit us up. And there you have it, guys. Mmm. See all the layers. So don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll be back with another video probably soon because we have nothing else to do. Bye.